leaving wonderful split Croatia. I unfortunately for the crew was the last passenger on board and they would have left 10 minutes earlier. Sunset. And yesterday, or no, the day before yesterday, no, yesterday, my sailing trip was to that port right there. And then we sailed back past the lighthouse into here. So the video that I took was right about just beyond that wind line there. Thank you, Croatia. What a great time. So worth it. Isn't that right? Sunset May 31st in on uh, the SNAV a ferry from Split to Ancona. Pretty sunset, but notice there are windmills on there. Croatia is really pushing the um, environmental thing. And there is Split. Oh, and just to remind me, I was the last one on this ship, and that's, there's two ships. That's the Croatian cruise line that's going from Split to Ancona. I'm in the Italian, and the last two people in the line were a woman, awesome, from Hanover, Germany, who's traveling alone around Europe for a month. But I misdirected her away because I thought I was this was the line for the Italian version, or Italian cruise line. It was actually the line for both the Italian and the Croatian line, and the Italian line left 30 minutes later. So she's on that boat. This boat is late because of me, because I didn't want to wait in line standing up. I just waited until the end of the everybody got through customs. So this, the crew's not really pleased with me. However, I did get one of the nicest cabins on the ship. It was only $100 and everybody else paid $50. There was a bunch of cars that paid more than that. And also, lesson number two for me, I think we need to go back to this situation here. We're in Split Croatia. And for some reason, there might be some licensing issues on this because my boat I'm not sure how to explain that. For a hundred dollars, you get to go across from Croatia to Italy in that boat. That is the boat that I'm on. <coughs> Still, I got issues with the licensing probably, as do others. Then here's the room. And I booked it as a single, but it can be a double, so which means that would flap down like on a train in Europe. And because I'm really fancy, I have a shower and a toilet, not a shared toilet. So for not a whole lot of extra money, um, it's not noisy in here. Quiet. I have power, water, beverages. 